It's insane to me the number of agents that are getting stuck on basically the buyer's agent compensation and whether a seller is going to pay in order for them to show a listing. First off, you should not be doing that. And buyer's agent, should you be calling the listing agent and asking if the seller is going to pay compensation? The answer is no, because think about it this way. Would you be calling them to ask them of other terms in the contract? Like, hey, can I put financing contingency in there? Could I put the um, earnest deposit as you know $10,000? Or can I have a financing contingency? It's like asking permission and weakens your negotiating stance. So it's a term of the contract. You should put it in there and negotiate. Come with the best terms to help uh, your client, the buyer, win the house and sellers and listing agents. When a buyer's agent asks you that question, if they happen to ask you the question, I'm sure you're gonna get tons of those, welcome them because you want the more people that come to the home, the better chance of selling it uh, for higher, you get better leverage. So tell them that you're open to it, right? It all depends on what the rest of the terms of the contract are. So to say, nope, I'm not gonna pay anything right off the bat, you could be deterring agents from even coming. They shouldn't be influenced by it, but it could deter them, okay? So the best thing to do is say, we're open to it but we need to see the rest of the terms of the contract. So come in with something strong and we'll look at it. And as long as the terms work out for the sellers, the seller might actually pay the buyer's agent compensation. So hopefully that gives you some perspective and helps you out in this situation because in a week, things are about to change and we're ready for it. Hope you are too. Take care.